It's a 28-20 game. Ace, Deuce, Deuce McAllister. 62 yards. Down to the five. He had 123 running three ball. Aaron Brooks does a little offense of his own. To Deuce McAllister, tied at seven. Worked on hoping he didn't lead to trouble. McAllister, man, just looking like the way he Now Forge on top, 17-13 until Deuce McAllister. 20 to 17, Saints. Fourth quarter. Which led to a safety. New NFL record, fifth straight game with two plus sacks for Simeon. Deuce McAllister didn't play last week. Six yards to the house this week. Still came in as the NFC's leading rusher without. 54 yards, Jake setting up a field goal. And then Deuce McAllister ices it. Three TDs, a buck 27. Hey. To the spot. Fourth quarter, Saints down one. Crucial third and two. The Deuce is loose. McAllister breaks two tackles. 16 yard gain. He was 18 of 69 rushing. And then Tommy, watch this catch. I mean, I ain't gonna say nothing about his move, but that ain't right. That ain't right either. <laughs> the Texans looked so impressive last week. The Saints did not. What? A theme today? Why don't we run it? Deuce McAllister, 24 yards, touchdown, Saints 7 9. Yeah, take another play at the game. Great blocking up front. You're going to see this offensive line create a nice scene. Deuce doesn't even have the ball yet. Everybody's on their blocks. Create enough of a scene, fullback lead, where he doesn't really even have to change directions. This is just the way you draw it up on the blackboard. You see the scene, you burst. And two touchdown underdog last week at Miami. They won nine uh, point uh, underdog this time. They lead 10 7 and a half. But Deuce McAllister breaks not one, not three, not three, not four, but five tackles to go 31 yards. Same drive. Deuce. Uh, uh, oh, he turns forward down to the two. Maybe. And then. Okay, so we got things moving in the pass game. What does that help? Well, this is the engine that makes the team run. You see him lined up in the shotgun. Direct snap to Deuce McAllister. Look at the time on the clock. 8.30 or so in the second quarter. Less than three minutes later, you run the exact same play. A clear indicator of part of what's wrong with Atlanta Falcon defense. They don't pick it up. McAllister is able to run that same play into the end zone. And then later on, here's McAllister again. Powering, getting outside. Again, these are the things we got used to seeing with the Saints a couple of years ago. The power of this man building up the yardage. A lot of Saints. Three touchdown passes, almost 300 yards. Brooks in the first half. Then McAllister under a minute to go leaping for 10 yards. 35 14. Saints route is on. The road team in this series just seems to do. Squad with a shutout last week over Dallas. They're playing the Saints, who beat them twice last year. Partly to the running of Deuce McAllister. Six straight 100-yard games for Deuce McAllister, a franchise record. That was 37 yards. And the Saints and Falcons go to overtime. Second and nine Saints. Deuce McAllister could go all the way for the win, except for one minor thing. It's a fumble. Too long. -y. There. We hand off to McAllister. Two hands on the ball. And he busts into the clear, a 23-yard game. The Eagles have won five in a row. They are as hot as anyone in football. The screen to Deuce McAllister early. Now watch this sequence. He's tackled just short of the end zone. Next play, it's Deuce. Uh, one ref calls a touchdown. Other ref doesn't call. Jim Haslett decides that we don't review it. And wouldn't you know it, the next play, it's Joe Horn frustrated because his team down 17 nothing. Damn. Ace, Deuce, he's plenty of use. He could go Oh. Oh, wait, look at the separation, Tom. Always had the speed. This is the reason. Deuce McAllister trying to climb his way up a very impressive list, looking for nine straight 100-yard games. Would he get it? Well, here's half of it right here in the second quarter. 52-yard run by Deuce, who's on the loose. He had 165 yards today. That would lead to a field goal. The Saints lead 10-7. Suing Saints kickoff. Stay mathematically alive at the Saints, a team that beat them both times last year, not to mention this year. Look at the headless horseman, Deuce McAllister, hit by John Lynch, Ooh, loses the hell. And the closer was on the road, too. Saints down 24 6. That was a two point conversion, miscue. But Deuce McAllister is going to score. They're not out of it. Saints are in business. So instead, with eight minutes to go, instead of the Packers driving, Ace and Deuce.
Deuce, Deuce McAllister, 23 yards, 34-20 to Saints, four and a half to go. Uh, you got to make so much preparation for him. Here's a guy leading the league. He's leading the league in reception. Watch this. You keep going. There, this guy's got to benefit greatly. Deuce McAllister having a great season. When you prepare for Reggie Bush, somebody else is going to come over. Win out game available to Drew Brees. Drew Brees is terrific at manipulating the defense. Oh, man, this offense is starting to come to life down in New Orleans. Reggie had 63 yards receiving, 23. He's done this his whole life. You're listening, coach. Purdue. You're listening. He did it in high school. He did it at Purdue. He did it like with, with the Chargers, and he's doing it with the Saints. He is the he's the heart and soul of this football team. Believe me, you like back, back. Deuce loose again. He missed the final 11 games of last season following knee surgery, and you can't even quantify this. Team two touchdowns. Steelers are up by 14. You've got to see this again to understand what happened. Deuce McAllister scores. Was it a fumble, Ruski? Uh, Jeff Fain, our center, will tell you he said he just got caught in the ground, and so he basically just rolled back to Deuce, and it was the best best looking trick play you've ever seen. It wasn't intended to be a trick play. We thought it was a fumble, Ruski. Two touch. And the pitch to Deuce McAllister. Cutting up field. And a good run by McAllister. Bounces off a couple of defenders. Some poor tackling by the Falcons as a flag goes down. As Deuce McAllister, who has been active the last four games with an injury, blocking for Deuce McAllister, who goes in for the touchdown. The Saints using two tight ends in Conwell and Miller. And McAllister goes in, and all of a sudden, boos emanate from the Georgia Dome. You get right out here on the perimeter. You show your big formation to the right side. You run out to the weak side. Jamar Nesbitt does a good job coming out, getting the kick out block. Deuce McAllister walks in for six. Saint fans elated over the doings today. Hand off. point to add to an incredibly frustrating day to the Falcons and the Saints are going to win this one going away. Hey, you don't think this is going to add fuel to the fire the first time the Saints and Falcons play next year? Throw by Campbell. Ooh, 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 ooh. It was Mike McKenzie, <laughs> one of the McKenzie brothers. Then Breeze, the screen to Deuce McAllister. McAllister rumbling, bumbling, stumbling. 20-yard gain later in the drive. Deuce on the loose. Around the corner, the Saints are within 10-7. Now it's a 13-10. The glory of the Niners and Saints, especially the Saints offense, when that guy, Deuce McAllister, is running, Merrill. He changes that offense. You know what? He gives them the compliment. They have the passing game horizontally, vertically, you name it. But can they finish and can they set their offense and their tempo with this guy? If he can stay healthy, the Saints are as complete an offense as there is in football. Without him, they lack that dimension. He gives them that presence, which you look at. Buy into now, Trent. Absolutely. When he's there, you get the safeties in the corners looking to the backfield. And in your corner, the best deep ball throwing quarterback in the NFL, Drew Brees, another big play down the field to Robert Meacham. Cutler. 52 yard completion, yep. stop it. Uh, then Yamo be there, up and over McAllister, his first touchdown since week 16 of 2006. That's right, I said it, Michael McDonald. <laughs> All right, ended up. Good quarterback tackle. Hey, Emmett, who is Deuce? Deuce Staley is the nose, is the guy that runs it, runs the ball in short yard situations and goal line situations. He's